His T-shirt says it all. When it comes to justice, Senator Stuart Sivray doesn't believe in Jersey's legal system and he's making a very public stand about it. Here in London now for six months, the estranged politician seeking legal asylum. No such protection exists, but so far he's refused to return to the island or his political seat. And why? Well, he says he's defending a war waged against him. The enemy, as far as the senator's concerned, are his fellow politicians and the legal system. In fact, everything he sees as the establishment, he claims he's being harassed, that his house was illegally broken into, his phone's being tapped, and they're the reasons why they found his out-of-date driving license. Of course, that's all before we even mention the alleged breaches of the data protection law on his website and the reason for his arrest. Despite numerous court appearances, he claims a fair trial is impossible. So when the senator failed to turn up to his last court date, an arrest warrant was circulated. But Senator Sivray's decision to dodge the law and stand against the establishment looks set to cost him his job. If he's not back in the island by Monday, he'll have been absent for six months and it marks the end of his political career. In fact, the only guaranteed welcome for Senator Sivray when he comes back to Jersey is a court appearance at the earliest possible opportunity or a prison cell in here with his name on. Of course, there's speculation he will come back and stand as a candidate for his own seat at a future by-election. But to put yourself forward, you've got to be in Jersey for a minimum of six months, with the election likely to take place in May and the senator's maximum residency at that point a handful of weeks. Jersey's 12th senator isn't likely to be Stuart Sivray.